Hey YouTube, this is Lady Katsuna here. Hello new subscribers, welcome to the family. Yeah, I got off of work hours ago. I just finished a chapter in my book, My Voodoo Queen, on Wattpad, W-A-T-T-P-A-D. Yeah, it's about a young woman, a voodoo priestess. She's supposed to be the strongest of them all. She's created from the earth by her Afro-Brazilian mocha skin voodoo priestess mother and her Brazilian shaman mother. Yeah, they're lovers. Anywho, she has multiple mates. A vampire, a weird hyena, a weird jaguar, a werewolf and a phoenix. Again, it's my voodoo queen. V O O D O O. Anywho, I'm on dating sites. I'm trying to look for a husband since we can't go outside. I'm getting a little weight due to coronavirus. And I'm eating like the fatty I am. Alright, I meet this cute guy. He messaged me. He's like, hello, beautiful kissy face. I said, hello. How are you? I'm good, you. He's like, I'm fine, you. I think he said his name. Sorry, I ate some sushi a while ago. He's like, John, you? I said, hi, fine, and tired. He was like, huh? I was like, I said my name. And I was like, oh, I just got off of work. It's not even a second. And this guy is talking about... Baby, I want to be your sugar daddy. You don't have to send me news. None of that. Just talk to me or over the phone. Message me. And I'll give you my, I'll pay your bills. And I told him straight up, I'm looking for a husband, not a sugar daddy. Okay, first of all. Any sugar babies out there, I'm not knocking on your hustle. You ain't do anything to me. You didn't say anything bad to me. As far as I know. Here's the thing. Yeah, I put on some curling activator and it's starting to flake. On my day off, I'm going to shower and scrub it real good. Anywho. And it's nighttime. Anywho. Look, I have nothing against anyone I shouldn't judge. I'm a 27-year-old virgin who hasn't been in a meaningful relationship in her life. I tried to go on a date once, but he bailed on me. No phone call. Well, he couldn't call me. He didn't get my phone number. I told him where to meet, and he flaked. I tried to go on another date. My father put a stop to it, so I had to tell the guy my father wouldn't let me. Kind of sad, huh? Anywho, I'm not interested in having a sugar daddy because once I do something he wouldn't like, he's going to probably flip out, and I don't want a whole breaking my knees for his money back situation. Because I don't like being indebted to people. I like earning my own money. And I don't want to have to do anything strange for a piece of change just to survive. No offense, sugar babies. No offense.
I mean, really, I haven't had much luck with dating since either guys ghost me or I'm too busy at work. I live with my father still. I can't afford a place of my own, but I can't wait to move out. Anywho. I want a decent guy. He doesn't have to be perfect. He doesn't know such thing as perfect. A decent guy who's financially stable. Or stable-ish. He doesn't have to be rich or a doctor or a lawyer. I mean, somebody who... Mm, is willing to make his own money because... With my salary, yeah, it's not going to cut it. I mean, if he's mentally ill but high-functioning, like Andre Lyon on Empire, I don't really watch the show, but I watch clips of it. Yeah, I want to see if I can actually, you know, hold my own with a person who's mentally ill but high-functioning. Because I can't have mentally ill but not functioning since my salary, ooh, we're going to be some struggling mofos. Yeah, I'm not into the whole guy paying for everything. I want to have my own money because if anything were to happen to him, yeah, I have already had a hard time finding jobs. For some reason, well, Tenny, most of the time I bomb interviews or I'm not qualified. I'm not qualified enough. Ugh, this curling activator. I had to put some vitamin E oil to help with the flaking. Oh, it's not helping that much. Anywho, I haven't heard from the guy or John for hours now. I'm pretty sure he ghosted me. Anyway, deuces.